More than 16,000 people rallied in Armenia's capital on Wednesday night to protest against the election of former President Serge Sarkisian as Prime Minister. Critics say the leader's switch of jobs after a decade as president amounts to a power grab and undermines the country's democracy. Students are willingly taking a stand as they realize that protests are important. They represent a battle for their rights and freedoms. I believe the police have been using excessive force to try and control the demonstrators. The use of a grenade that exploded right next to me injuring my leg was simply unacceptable. It once again shows they're capable of killing people. Although protest numbers were down on previous nights, Organizers have vowed to mount a nationwide campaign of civil disobedience. They closed the entrances to the buildings of state institutions. Police officers regularly take into the custody groups of demonstrators. The leader of the movement, Nikol Pashinyan, announces peaceful velvet revolution. Amici Chekian from Yerevan to Euronews.